it really opens a new era of hope for the treatment of patients with advanced liver cancer. We have um, run, I think one estimate um, says over a hundred clinical trials of different types of agents for advanced liver cancer and almost all of those have been uniformly unsuccessful in part because um, often those agents or combinations of agents that are successful show side effects that are too um, severe or intolerable for patients. So this really gives us the opportunity to have an agent that um, was effective, um, that appeared to be reliably effective and was also quite well tolerated by patients with advanced liver cancer who generally have um, the challenge of also having other underlying liver disease from liver cirrhosis. And so that makes them in general more difficult to manage than the average cancer patient.